Hi Dr. Friends, today's topic is a uh, most common topic that is uh, most commonly asked in Neat PG, Amps PG, that is the triad and pentards. So I have list uh, about such uh, triad and pentard. So you have uh, to retain it and make a note of such a triad. Thanks friend for watching and start with such a great topic. First of all, I will. I am starting with tried of Alport syndrome. Alport syndrome. That is the first sensory neural deafness, progressive renal failure, and ocular abnormalities. So, next topic is alcaptonuria. Alcaptonuria, that means the alcaptan formation. It is uchronotic arthritis, uchronotic pigmentation, you is dark on a standing. <clears throat> then after Anderson tried Anderson tried is bronchiectasis cystic fibrosis vitamin A deficiency then Anderson so you can retain it by A B C Anderson tried A B C A4 vitamin A deficiency, B4 bronchiectasis, C4 cystic fibrosis. Next is Bechet's syndrome tried. So Bechet, it is the recurrent oral ulcer, genital ulcer and iridocyclitis. Then Backstride. Backstride is muffled heart sound, distended neck vein, and hypotension. That means cardiac tamponade. You may ask such type of the question in the tried. Then instead of hypotension, it may be their cardiac tamponade. So this list have to retain you. Next one is Fanconi syndrome tried. Fanconi syndrome tried is aminoaciduria, proteinuria, and phosphaturia. You can retain it by Fanconi. You may father. And next one is pop. Then Gradenigo tried. Gradenigo tried is sixth granular palsy, persistent ear discharge, and deep seated retro orbital pain. <coughs> so, persistent ear discharge is there in the Gradenigo syndrome. Next is retro orbital pain and sixth nerve palsy. Hutchinson tried. Hutchinson tried start with Hutchinson so Hutchinson teeth interstitial keratitis and nerve weakness so Hutchinson tried many times asked in the neat PG and Gradenigo syndrome next one is the hemolytic uremic syndrome tried hemolytic uremic syndrome tried so hemolytic that means hemolysis so anemia occurs <coughs> Thrombocytopenia. Next is the renal failure. Here written is uremic syndrome. So more urea, more the chances of the renal failure. Hemobilia. Hemobilia that is the melanoma. 
obstructive jaundice and the biliary colic hemobilia so you can retain it the trick is mob hemobilia start with here mob m for melena o for obstructive jaundice and b for biliary colic next one is sand stride sand stride is gallstone diverticulosis and hiatus hernia sand stride next is trotter stride trotter stride is conductive deafness immobility of homolateral soft plate and trigeminal neuralgia is the trotter stride virtual stride virtual stride is the stresis hypercoagulability and the vessels injury next one is whipple stride whipple stride is hypoglycemia during attack serum glucose 10% while that of hyper gamma globulinemia here whipple stride here gamma globulin is increased while that of glucose decreases and serum glucose becomes also decrease pentad of the ttp <coughs> here microangiopathic hemolytic anemia fever disturbed neurological function renal function failure thrombocytopenia next one is odonogitride it is a twisting force in the weight bearing knee joint cause injury to medial collateral ligament anterior cruciate ligament and medial meniscus is the donogitride next one is the cushing tride of increased intracranial pressure here bradycardia bradypnea and hypertension <coughs> generally bradycardia and bradypnea with hypertension is only in the cushing tride otherwise in the hypertension there is tachycardia Cartagner syndrome is the triad of bronchiectasis, recurrent sinusitis, and situs inverters. So, thanks for watching my video. Have a nice day.